She said goodbye her late in morning I think that all her bricks imported I don't think you drove enough Right now, we're gonna go to the Bronson Caves to vibe out and hang out and walk around and stuff. Well, I used to do this walk all the time. I used to come up here and hang out. These are so dirty and it's really fucking cool. What it is, is like the old back cave for the Batman shows back in like the 60s. So um, it's just, it's pretty cool. The vibe's right, the energy's good and the Hollywood signs literally like a couple hundred feet above you. So all in all, it's cool. And Jim Morrison used to like go up here and like trip on acid and trip on drugs and like have sex and just be Jim Morrison. So it's cool. It's an awesome place. They're always like filming shit up there, so I hope there's nothing being filmed. But yeah, that's where we're going right now. So over here you have your indigenous um, trash can <laughs> with with LA graffiti all over it. You know, the indigenous the indigenous people, LA. Yeah, I used to come up here in high school and like smoke weed and like do like things I wasn't supposed to because it's above the city, so you're not gonna get in trouble. Like no one's gonna come up here and burn you or anything like that. So as I got older, it's really peaceful. It's really fucking windy out today. Though I just come up here to clear my mind and stuff and like hang and chill. Um, I did a vi I feel weird. I did a video like a year, two years ago where I came up here and I did the same thing. But like this just shows you like how much I love this area. I just try to come up here as much as I can. So it's definitely a place that like I'm connected to in a sense, whatever. But it's really cool. Like I mean, this is the Bat Cave. Like this is the Bat Cave. It's the only there's only one in the world. We're standing in it. Crazy. So we just went to Bronson Canyon. Um, we didn't stay up there too long because it was extremely windy. The fucking rocks were flying everywhere and I'm covered in like soot. But on the upside, it was peaceful and it was what I needed. So I'm gonna go get some tacos now at Henry's Tacos because that's what I do after I go on a hike is I saturate my body with fat and cheese. And yeah. It's cash only at Henry's Tacos, the best place in LA. Like, I wanted, I wanted a taco. I don't have any cash on me, bro. I got money on my car. So we're going somewhere else. I don't know where we're gonna go. We're gonna figure it out. We'll figure it out. Salad boy, salad, salad game. Get on your healthy shit, even though it's covered in dressing. It's all about eating clean and drinking shitty. That's what it's about. Plus one was like really scary putting it out, but at the end, when it was all done, looking back at everything laid out, like song-wise, I was like, okay, it's time to put it out. This is really scary. Like, so far, everything's been a pretty warm response, and people are just really supportive, and that means like everything to me other than numbers or making things lucrative. Um, it's just all about that like momentum and that like grassroots love and that's exactly what's going on. So I would dub that as a success for sure. It took a lot like scrounging up money and working like weird jobs to put everything out and get it done. It feels really good to have like confidence behind the release finally. So a release finally like feels really good. I can't see your screen. Yo, my phone died. I'm in my, are you on the corner? Yeah, I'm like right by the gate. Oh shit, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna come outside. Let's stay on the corner.
Pick your fucking poison, right? I'm gonna do the pink and the orange. Yeah, or no, the there's thing. a green? Go check it out. Young Coco Musgrave. Go check it out on SoundCloud. RIP to my old hoes. Yeah. I'm gonna do the out. orange and the pink. I think that's the most lit. Yeah, I the pink but I don't want to take the most lit away from you. Yeah. Alright. Tell me about this Cali weed, man. Like, oh, dude. All it this stuff's really good, though, for the price. It's fucking like decent. Hella frosty and just like. It smells, smells really good. fucking great, dude. Like, actually smells like blueberry. Yeah. That shit goes in. That shit's fucking good. I'm used to playing on like a fucking apple box, like a crate. So we got really good venues and like. Well, look, I'm doing something in LA. Like I'm doing a full West Coast tour. I just have it. It's just it, 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 we're planning it out right now. The whole the whole project, I fuck with it because it just like sonically just flows, dog. Like from the build up to, to small talk to run, and it got the dark kid. I know <clears throat> it can't like back home was great, but there was no like identity to it. We're like this thing yeah. needs to have a fucking like identity, like yeah, yeah, yeah. like that yeah, exactly. Like, ex like that, and that's kind of what we're doing now. Is like we're working on like. Just like enhancing, like, oh, enhancing, like, kind of like all the all the visionaries from like my image to like the video. So it's just, it's cool. It's cool to have like a product that you just almost like you're like have to keep up with them. Like we were like, oh, like I was like, this music's so good. Like I have to be like all oh, my shit now. Yeah. You know, like, and that's great. Like that's what you want. Like I finally did it. So I'm stoked. I'm just trying to keep it alive. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm gonna get trolled. I'm gonna get trolled. What I should do is just like mock start out with the wormholes intro, and watch everyone who's like pretty good. Like, this is what I really came for. Hey man, peace out. Young Coco Musgrave out here. Shout out Michael Barr, best buddy. You know how the fuck we rocking? I don't wanna fake, don't wanna participate in your section. You can't relate, now you see me getting money from the cash yet I put my wax in the past yet and run around the city like